Hello everyone, this is Hoda Ganji and in this video I'm going to create a custom material in Rhino 8. So uh, I'm going to go to my shaded view here and maybe I can hide the roof under standard. Okay, so maybe that wall over there, I want to have part of it like this left part of it as a feature wall. So I'm going to split it using uh, this line. And now this part of it, I'm going to take it into a new sub layer and I'm going to name it wall cover. I'm going to move this to the new sub layer. And uh, to this wall cover, I'm going to assign a new material. Uh, and when I add a material, this time I want to go with a custom material. And it allows me to assign texture where it says color. I want to assign texture. So let's say maybe I have one of these uh, wall covers in mind. Let's try one of them. First, when you want to save the file, if it's trying to save it as WEBP, that's not very helpful. So I might go, instead of saving, I might go with uh, taking a screenshot and I want it to be a JPG or a PNG, one of the two would be better. Save this file. Then in Rhino, where it says color in the new material, which we can rename, of course, I can rename it as wall cover here, where it says color, I want to add a texture. Actually, I want to assign a photo, so I'll go with browsing folder. I'm going to select the wall cover. OK, OK, and OK. Then if I go back to my rendered view, you see that it considers that picture as one big picture here. But actually it's a, a repeated set of samples or modules. So in order to fix it, we'll go back to the settings and click on the name of the wall cover. Uh, when you scroll down here under mapping, I want to change this to WCS box style. Then now this number here shows the size of the image. So let's say if from this corner to this corner is one meter, I'm going to click here. My file is in millimeters. Double click to assign number. One zero 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 is one meter. Now it repeats that item. Uh, if you think it's going to be smaller or larger, feel free to change the size of the sample. Uh, remember to unhide the roof. Then you can go back to your camera views, uh, whether it was the yard view, that's the wall we worked on, or maybe the interior view. Uh, that's it for this video. Please like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you so much.